Okay, folks, and we're back here at the bench on this vacuum tube voltmeter by Heathkit. I've got it down to, I've been chasing my tail around here all day trying to figure out why I can't get this thing to do what it's supposed to do, and that's balance and go back and forth, okay? I tested the tubes. Thought, well, maybe the 12AU7 is bad. I tested the 6AL5, AL that's okay. Both tubes are good. Um, I said, okay, it's the 50K pot instead of the 10K pot. I took a 10K a audio pot and put in there. Still, can't get it to do what it's supposed to do. The meter seems to hang up, but if you watch, and when I blow on it, meter's free. It's not sticking. So I have a feeling there's something electrically wrong with the meter movement. I've taken care of the balance, okay? We know that I've balanced this out the way it's supposed to be. The meter's not, meter's not sticking in any way. Um, so what else is left? I mean, I don't know. So this is supposed to be a two, full scale, is supposed to be 200 microamps. All right, so what I've got this set up is you're gonna see 200 microamps over here. It's on the microamp scale. 200 microamps. This needle, this needle here should go to full scale. Get it in there so you can see it better. Again, this needle should go full scale. 200 microamps. Uh, 202 microamps. It's not full scale. I mean, I'm blowing on it. It's bouncing back and forth. It's not hung up. There's something wrong with the meter. The meter is totally disconnected from the circuit board. I'm stuck. What do I do? I'm reaching out to the community out there. <laughs> Other than scrapping this out and, and throwing it away, um, I can buy a meter replacement. People are selling them on eBay. It's $35. It's more than what the unit's worth <laughs> on eBay. So I'm kind of stuck. I'm at a point where I'm not going to do any more work on it until I can figure out and get this meter movement to do what it's supposed to do. Because unless I can make the meter full scale at 200 microamps, uh, there's no sense in going any further. Anybody has any suggestions? Truly appreciate them. Reach out, send me a comment. Um, what does it take to go to full scale? Well, I'll use my variable supply here. That's about as close as I can see. There you go. 296 microamps to go full scale instead of 200. Again, let's... See if I can zero in on 200. Not easy because it's just a regular, it's actually an audio pot I'm using. So 200.9. That's it. That's all she wrote. And you can see, uh, hopefully you can see, it's 200 microamps over here. Not 200 microamp full scale on the meter. It's definitely going to be a problem. Anybody has any suggestions, please leave a comment. Thanks for the community, for anything you can send me.